So far, here we are back inside Toyota Center, Houston, Texas. And it seems like every time the UFC comes here, something special happens. UFC 192, obviously an epic title fight between you and Alexander Gustafson. UFC 166, one of the greatest fight cards of all time. Houston's got another one in store tonight. Yes, tonight you have a chance to make your own history. We saw Melendez versus Sanchez. Me and Gustafson put on a show there. Velasquez and Dos Santos put on a show there. Will you be remembered like we have at the Toyota Center? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Single collar tie now. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Nice leg kick land. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how how good that feels to get kicked like that. Not it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Takedown landed now by Anderson. Oh, tags him with that money left again. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Anderson. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him, know when, when to fold him. Yep, there you absolutely. Go. Joy gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike wow. lands there. Actually got the takedown. 30 seconds to go. Oh, reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom fight. Oh, right in the mouth. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Five minutes in the books. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides here. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. Recover, shake it off. That round doesn't matter. We're gonna move forward this round and really put the pressure on this guy. Let's take him out of his element. All right, round two is now upon us. Pretty competitive first five minutes, I thought. It's exactly what we expected. We expected when we saw this on the match sheet that these two guys were evenly matched. Let's see who really takes control as we go into the second round. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Oh! Nice punch there. Size advantage, and he put it to good use there. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, he may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land. He's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Oh, nice punch there by Choi. Good series of punches by him there. He has been busy throughout. He's doing a great job with the hands. He looks like a professional boxer out there. Anderson's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's 
broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Big punch lands through the middle. That right hand hurt him a little bit. And they separate. Real sneaky body kick. All right, closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. And both guys really throwing with authority. Big kick land. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Let's go. One minute left in the round. What a takedown. Oh, and he gets the single leg takedown. Nice entry on that attempt. 45 seconds remain in the round. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by the Korean Super Bowl. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic tweet. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was. DC, take us through the replays. Punch after punch. He landed him at will. He went right at his opponent, got in his face, and showed, this is my octagon. We are going to dance to the beat of my two. All right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round goes on. I expect the action to really pick up. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Big kick land. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Anderson. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Just missing on the uppercut oh, there. Man. All right, so a high amplitude double leg takedown there. Now we'll see what he can do with it to try to advance position on the ground. You knew that he was going to attack the double because he's such an explosive guy. He got it on the hips, finished the shot very quickly. Fantastic job. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Pretty good ground and pound by him here. He told us on Thursday he needed to be more effective in these situations. Certainly effective tonight. Many people have gone away from this style of fighting. This man has embraced it, and you are seeing why he's one of the best that we've seen do it in a long time. Oh, nice slip there. It sounds simple, right? Hit and don't get hit, but this guy's defense has been sharp tonight. Cat mouth, you gotta play cat mouth. Hit, don't get hit. He does a great job of that. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. What a punch. What a body kick. Oh, nice. Nice. Diggy kick. And just misses with that big right hand. Throws the left hand. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, man, look at that. Victor perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Oh! Huge right hand! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! 
He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Choi gets caught with that punch. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Ooh, head kick lands. All right, so a lot of highlights over those previous five minutes. DC, take us through the replay, if you will. A lot of good action, but punching led the dance. Punching was the thing that stood out to me. That allowed him to take control of the round. All right, DC, here we go with our next round. It wasn't just the accuracy, it was the aggressiveness. So the it was unbelievable to watch him be so active. The cardio, the push, the pace, and the pressure that he fought with. It's going to be very interesting to see if he can maintain this over 15 minutes. Big kick. Just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by the Korean Super Bowl. Comes in close, controls his opponent's posture, and lands these nasty old. Anderson's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. That one appeared to stun him. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Beautiful strike. Back and forth we go. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Keeping busy here on the clinch. And they separate. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Anderson. Very nice leg kick there by Chor. Punch over the top. Punch to the body is blocked. Liver kick. Unable to connect with the right hand there. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Uppercuts right on the chin. 45 seconds remain in the round. Lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. All right, single collar tie now. Choi gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Great, no more strikes. Stop, stop. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that one. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Next round is underway, and I'm no fighter, but these guys look pretty fresh to me. It's insane to be able to carry that workload that well. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Wow. Oh, nice. 
Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Chor. The right hand just misses. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. That was snuck in. Nice strike. Anderson's kick is blocked. The Korean Superboy gets caught by that straight hand. You like this guy. I like this guy. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Wow, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing damage. Oh, yeah, no pity pat to this guy. This guy's trying to land, and he's trying to land effective strikes. And he's back to his feet. Good sign for him there. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah, no more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision, or you can lose by decision. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. Oh! He needs to start looking at the finish now, because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. And just like that, the fight is over! He's done! He's done! Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Chong. Oh, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You go.